I'm a storyteller. I tell stories, but I'm not, I can't sing at all. I'm like totally tone deaf. I learned many Navajo stories. I wanted to teach them to my grandchildren, and so I thought it would be easier to learn the stories if not only did they hear them, but they could experience them visually. I always tell them this Navajo story about how you're not supposed to compare yourself to one another, that you're each unique, and that's what complements them as a team. <laughs> I love the Arapaho makerspace. They have all kinds of arts and crafts supplies and equipment. I made the, each of the grandkids a star quilt uh, for Christmas, and uh, I use the sewing machines. They have really good sewing machines. I don't get distracted. I'm able to work for extended periods of time in their space. And it's true, because if I stay home, I go make coffee, I want to eat, blah, blah, blah. Then I started making the regalia for my granddaughters. Regalia is uh, a dance outfit for a Native American person. Dance is just a way of connecting to Mother Earth and all of the Indian spiritual beings. When I go to the Castle Wood Library, I get tremendous support from the staff. They loved my projects. It really made me feel good because there were many people there doing very high-tech work, and here I was with a needle and a thread. staff really helped me pursue my dreams of continuing my heritage, my culture.